All right, so I put the 960 EVGA FTW in now. It's a four gig. Running at 1080p and uh, ultra high settings. I think I'm maxing it out. I don't have super sampling on. I turned that off. Everything else is maxed out. I think you can go high. You can't go, you can't go ultra. Yep, everything's maxed out. Yep, 86, 85, 84. Nice. All right, so 1440p. It's 50s. 45. So yeah, if you have a 960, or if you're thinking about getting a 960, you know, play this game. Uh, well, I don't know your CPU that you have or you're thinking about getting. This is a i5-7500, so I guess you can compare that on Google. But um, yeah, at 1440p, you're going to have to lower a couple settings down, because this is maxed out. So just lower it a little bit and you can get 60s and 70s pretty easy. So yep, yeah, that was 1440p, maxed out Sniper Elite 3. That's the little benchmark. There you go. All right, Black Ops 4, 1080p, 75% rendering. High medium settings. Um, yeah, 960, Let's see how it performs. All right, so I was getting 80s and 90s, so I did 100% scaling, 100% uh, rendering at 1080p. Wow. <laughs> so, um, 57 right now, it's hard to tell the GPU, um, is in the way right there. High 50s to 60s and some sometimes 70s. So high medium settings. 1080p. All right, 960, 1080p. Everything is on the highest setting. I am wrong. It changed because I had a different card and it just auto did it or something. I'm not sure. Okay, one second. Okay, everything is on ultra. Here it goes. I think it saves. Let me back it out. Okay, I did save. Alright, running benchmark. 1080p Dirt 3 maxed out. <laughs> Alright, so Dirt 3 maxed out. Um, 100 high 90s, low 100. There you go. All right, so <laughs> 1440p maxed out. All right, so six, I saw 59, but I got it to 66. That's the highest I saw. So yeah, I can handle 1440p on Dirt 3, maxed out. I'm gonna try 4K as well, just for the heck of it, and I'm gonna lower some settings. Mm. 
So there's the result of 1440p maxed out Dirt 3 with a 960 and an i5-7500. Changed it to 4K now. I turned multi-sampling off and high settings only. So, yep, 60s right there. High 50s and 60s. Not bad. 65C on the GPU. There we go. 4K high settings. No multi sampling on a 960 Dirt 3. Alright, so that's the score. I'm gonna do 4K now. This is at 1440p now. Just seeing if the you know gameplay is different than the benchmark. Obviously, it's not doing the same exact task. So 140s. I'm holding it with my hand, so I'm just gonna run around real quick. So 126, 131, 129. a 4k test now same settings I just changed the resolution to 4k oops sorry so 75 he's using a little bit more of his GPU now So those are his results for 4K. Same settings as the 1440, just change resolution. A benchmark with the 980 at 1440p now. Same settings. So yeah, 1440p using more CPU, 73 to 97 I saw, yep. I don't have the temperature of the CPU, but it, it gets to like 45 I think. But yeah, the frame rate's 120, 125 to 135 or so. That's the result to the 1440 test, Dirt 3 maxed out at 1440. Alright, so I'm doing a test with Dirt 3 at 4K. You can't change, you can, um, you can raise the 4X MSAAA, but when you do it, there's a problem and like the whole thing is green, like the screen is green, you can't see anything, or if it's black or green or something like that. I did it once and you have to look up a video how to fix it. So you keep it at 4X MSAAA and then the settings are the highest thing they can go. And we do a benchmark. No. This is with the 980 still. Alright, so that's what the 980 got. Yep, averages are about 60-62. Alright, so real quick. Oh, sorry. Alright, so real quick, showing you the settings. 1440p and high medium. 72 frames. They're both CPU and GPU are pretty much maxed out completely, but it's very smooth at 65 to 82 
Averages in the high 60s to low 70s. So the frame buffer, it's going in the in game, it's saying um, it's past the frame buffer, which is 4 gigs. And it's only getting 32 right now at 4K. So if you lower the render. Alright, this is my brother playing in the background with a controller. He doesn't use controller, obviously. We are PC. Oh, the refresh rate. I don't know why that changed. The hertz. Ah, come back. Alright. So that's one of the reasons why it was so bad. I'm going to do 75% of 4K, which is still higher than 1440p. 60 um, hertz now. So. Right, there we go. That's that, that's 60 hertz. Okay. Oh, he's dead. Awesome. Perfect. So 40s. Low 40s, high 30s. So I would turn a couple settings down or... Yeah, 980 good. They can't handle Black Ops 4 at 4K. You'd have to turn down settings a lot. Might as well just play at 1440 higher settings and get like 70s and 80s. Yeah. So we swap we swap sides, um, low 50s and uh, high 40s. 68C on GPU. I don't know the fan speed. I don't have it activated up there in the MSI uh, afterburner overlay. And the CPU is at 95 to 100 percent. Drops in 83 sometimes. I have 12 bots on. They're all in recruit just for the test, you know. Like I think 12 or 13 bots, and then it, it swapped sides, made it even. So. But yeah, this is at 4K high medium, 75% render. Oh. <laughs> Alright, 1440p, maxed out. Average 155 at 1440 maxed out. This 4K, maxed out. Seventy nine to um, I saw some nineties, but yeah, nice. Everything's maxed out. 4K, high eighties, low nineties. Alright, so I'm testing Tomb Raider at 1440p now. Same setting as before. And almost 200 frames at 1440p. Alright, 4K test now. Same settings. 97 average. Oh, crap balls. Whatever. Wow, that's. Sniper Elite 3 at 1440, and advanced options are the same like the other tests. Alright, I'm going to do a benchmark. So 1440p, same settings. It's getting 60s. Oh, sorry. Fuck. <laughs> Cut. <laughs> 1440p, same settings. He's getting 72 to some uh, upper 90s. And 4K is getting 44. So yeah, I would have to lower a few settings. 